This is the Presto Eversharp electric knife sharpener. You can get it on Amazon right now for $27.54. It's Amazon's highest rated electric knife sharpener at four and a half star reviews, four and a half stars and 406 reviews. So it's been quite highly reviewed. Uh, the main reason I'm doing this video is because before I bought this last week, I really couldn't find any any decent videos on how to use it or even just you know a review so I thought you know I do this to show you know everyone anyone else that you know the pros and cons of this device so let's get to it um, it has it's a two-stage uh, sharpener it has a coarse and a fine stage it has blade guides which help you uh, position it the knife correctly so that you get the proper angle uh, they pressed the Presto uses what they call sapphire sharpening wheels, which I think is just a marketing trick. I don't think it actually, you know, there's such thing as sapphire because they have a trademark on sapphire. So I think it's if anything, it's just a marketing trick, a marketing tactic. Um, whether or not this that's impressive to you is really up to you. Um, the bottom it has three suction cups, uh, pretty well designed. It has two cleaning ports to get rid of all the filings, and it's a pretty average built. I wouldn't say it's well built because uh, you can see the guides they kind of wiggle a little bit, <laughs> and it's not the best. But at twenty seven fifty four, you really can't complain. It, it's quite a good value. And it does what it does okay, does it pretty well. So let's get to it. So you turn it on. And uh, to show you how to use it, I'm using a meat cleaver. Um, and uh, the directions say that you want to pass the, the blade on uh, each side about three times. Uh, I already sharpened this knife, so I'm just going to do it once just to show you how it's done. So you do it through the first stage. And you want to put it down, and you don't want to press too hard because you'll, because it's an electric grinding wheel, you will grind away. You will cause a divot in your knife edge, and you don't want that. So you just pass through. Let the weight, let the weight of the knife uh, be adequate pressure. So just pass it through. And that's the first side. And then you want to pass it through the second. So that's the coarse edge, and now you want to do go through the fine edge. And now through the final stage. And there you go, and it creates a pretty good edge as you can probably see from the gleam. Uh, you're probably gonna wanna going to want to use a sharpening steel or hone just to get rid of all the burr and probably wipe it with a wet towel to get rid of all the filings that stick onto the blade. Um, it produces a pretty good edge. Uh, I don't really like the angle. I believe it's a 30 degree angle. It's not what I would like for a knife but it does sharpen pretty well and if you have a decent knife you really only need to use the second stage at you know so I do like the you know that it it's quite easy to to do it the guides do help a bit uh, one thing I don't like is that Presto advertises that you can use this for sport knives, which tend to be a little thicker. This is my, uh, this is my Kershaw Ken Onion Blade Blur, and uh, it produces a pretty good edge. But you, as you can see, right at right here, because it's so thick, you can't really get into the into the guide, so it produces a very inconsistent edge at the end. Um, I'm Maybe there's a way to fix that. I don't know if anyone can uh, point me to 
point me to like a demonstration, I would appreciate it. Uh, but it does what it does pretty well. So that's the Presto EverSharp electric knife sharpener.